Safe. What be your name? I'm Dr. George Washington. What? Dr. George Washington. All right, wicked. So does vets mainly look after sick animals? No, we do a lot of preventive medicine, reproductive work and everything. Why was there so many sick animals in Vietnam? There, there wasn't that many sick animals in Vietnam. But weren't there like millions of Vietnam vets? You're confusing terminology here. Okay, a veterinarian is a doctor of veterinary medicine. He's a person that treats animals. For will. So, ah, it's getting it. So loads of people went to Vietnam and then treated animals there. No, no, no. You're confusing the term. All right. I'm a veteran, but I'm also a veterinarian because I served time as a veterinarian in the military. For will. So why do so many of those people from the military then later on in life want to start working with animals? They don't. They can do anything they want to. There's no relation between a veteran of the military right. and a veterinarian. Respect. And you is? I'm both. Oh man, that's so confusing. I, I, I don't <laughs> understand it. So to make this clear to young people out there, people who fights in wars is called veterinarians. No, people who are called veterans. Whatever, veterans, people who does the animal thing is called veterina vet Ve veterans. No, veterinarians. Veterinarians. V -E -T -E -R -I -N -A -R. Respect. V-E-T-E-R-I-N-A-R. It's veterinarians. When you was a kid, did you know that you wanted to grow up and be a veteran? Well, you're still confusing. Just, just forget the word veteran. All right. Please. How often is animals actually sick and how often is they faking it just so them can get a day off work? Animals aren't faking it to get a day off work. But what does you do if there's like a knock on your door and there's like a goat out there, whatever, and he says he's got flu, but you know he's lying? Does a you goat, tell the farmer? The goat doesn't talk to us. It's the farmer that talks to us. So is there a lot of sex diseases with animals? There are a few, but not many that's transmitted. So is there any animals that ain't being discovered yet? There could be. They've just found some in some of the jungles, different places that they didn't know exist. Has you got any photos of the ones that ain't being discovered? No. All right, what about a video or something like? Well, if you had a video, they'd have been discovered. All right, not if they videoed themselves. They, they aren't smart enough to operate a video. You aren't going to see that chicken there taking a video around. All right. He doesn't have enough. His brain is not developed enough. Yo, for man, him can hear you saying that. Don't cuss him. I'm not. I'm not cussing him. I say he doesn't. His brain is not developed enough. He's like just there. He's going to hear you say that and be like, well, upset, isn't it? No, he's not. No. Look at that. that. What's that? That's a chicken. What? That thing? It's a chicken. Is that a real animal? That's a chicken. Check it out. Has you ever seen anything like that? Yeah. Look at it. He's got feathers on his feet. <laughs> How come he is wearing that? So where is, like, the tigers? The, this is not a zoo. This is a farm. This is like, uh, uh, this is more like a farm you would have seen probably when I was a kid. What about a hippopotamus? Hippopotamus, there, you go to the National Zoo and you can see them. What, you ain't got them here either? No, this is not a zoo, this is a farm. You know what a farm is? Well, it's like a rubbish zoo, obviously. Okay, I hope you learned something about animals. Yo, me learn a lot because about you animals. Have, you have a lot to learn. Keep it real. Okay. Enough respect. Okay. Safe. Safe. Wicked. Okay.